What is it? No more Bruticus! No more harm will come to the humans! That decision's been taken out of your hands, Defensor! Yours too, Cyclonus! Anyone here get hurt? No one, Otopoto-san. Well, that's one piece of good news anyway. Rodimus, if I may intrude, I'm receiving a rather vehement transmission. You're wanted at the Imperial Palace. Yeah. I'll just bet I am. Hey, I am well aware of the damage that's been done, but we stopped the Decepticons from... This is very bad for business. You frighten locals and scare tourists away. Yeah, then maybe you ought to try protecting yourselves. Your presence and the presence of others like you does endanger us. Heck of a day. Tell me about it. I was at the Imperial Palace all afternoon with the Prime Minister. Ah, yeah, you've had worse times. Yeah, when do they get better? That's what I want to know. What's eating you? I don't know, Cup. I feel boxed in. Like the weight of the world rests on your shoulders. Yeah. Like you want to run away? And how? Uh, the responsibilities. Hey, Rodimus, we've got a problem. Earth Defense Command needs... Not you two. Give me a break, will you? Since when am I the only one who can solve everybody's problems? But... But you... <laughs> Just leave me alone! <laughs> What's with him? Giri. Giri? Japanese word. It means the burden hardest to bear. Ah, he's feeling the pressures of leadership, is that it? Same thing happened to Optimus Prime after the Matrix was passed to him. Optimus learned to live with his Giri and respect it. And now it's Rodimus's turn. Is there anything we can do to help? Nope. He's got to resolve it for himself. Still, maybe he could use somebody to talk to. If I could turn into a car, this is where I'd blow off steam. Everybody else went back to char. How come we have to stay behind? We got orders! Watch for Autobot activity! Like that clownoid, for instance! <laughs> Is that you? It's me, Fairborn. We need to talk. You talk. I'd rather race. Okay, Mr. Matobot. If that's the way you... <gasps> That spinner's gaining on us. <laughs> Let's waste that dinkus. Marissa, hang on, Marissa. <laughs> he done blow up real good. Yes. Let's go get a good look. Yes. <laughs> 
It's the Matrix. The secret to the Autobot's power. Yeah! <laughs> Galvatron's gonna love this. <laughs> now we can go back to Char. <laughs> Come on, you miserable sheep! Move! Rodimus! Rodimus, can you hear me? Rodimus, answer me! Rodimus! You have done well. For years, the Matrix has eluded us, but now... It is finally ours! At last, all shall be won! <laughs> Under Galvatron's rule! You dropped it, didn't you? You broke the Matrix, didn't you? Take this and destroy it! But, mighty Galvatron, you agreed to return it. I lied! If we can't have it, then no one shall! The Matrix is the key to the universe. What did you say? But nothing. Then do as you are ordered! Get rid of it! They do not understand. The Matrix is no mere weapon, no simple energy source. It is power, ultimate, unfathomable power. Is how you found him? Yes. Will he be all right? Difficult to say. From your description, it sounds like Wild Rider and Dead End made off with the Matrix. What does that mean? Is it of any use to the Decepticons? That's hard to say also. <sighs> He's awakening. Oh, my wicked head. What hit me? What hit you? What are you all staring at? You look like you've seen a ghost. We have. Hot Rod. Hot Rod? You no longer possess the Matrix. Yeah. I thought I felt something different. How do you feel, Roddy? Strong enough to go after him? Wait a minute. What's the rush? The Matrix is the essence of the Autobots. Our link to our history and our future. Without it... Aren't you getting a little carried away here? I'm still me, you're still you, Matrix, Matrix. Hot Rod, listen to what you're saying. I know exactly what I'm saying. I'm telling you, all of you, that I'm sick of being responsible for the preservation of the universe and its outlying suburbs. Day in and day out, punch this Decepticon, bash that Decepticon. What's the point? This has been going on for a few dozen millennia now, and I don't see it changing, do you? You want the Matrix back? Swell. Go get it. But find some other sucker to carry it. Cause I quit. With the Matrix destroyed, now, now is the time to unleash our fury upon them and crush them. Bow down to me, Galvatron. Bow down to scorn. Annihilate all of our robots and lead all of the Decepticons! Leader Scourge? Leader of the Decepticons? Only Galvatron leads! Only Galvatron! Here's Rambo. 
Rage must cease! on a mission against Earth and the Autobots. Only Galvatron leads. I will not rest until the Matrix and Scourge have been destroyed! Ultra Magnus, uh, come quickly. What is it, Captain? We're at warp gate 09A, a ship approaching. Springer, sensor identification. Do the words Decepticon Armada mean anything to you? Cut anything? Not a peep out of Hot Rod. We're gonna have to handle this one without him. What were you thinking? To be as forceful as possible. Why? Because I... Thought I was not aggressive enough. Rid yourself of thinking. Don't expect to win. Don't expect to lose. But, Sensei, what should I expect? Expect nothing. Nothing? Nothing. Go now. We have finished for today. You are troubled, Otobotosan? Who, me? Uh, you are lying, Otobata-san. Yeah, I am. You wonder why I tell young Ozu to banish thinking, to expect nothing. You wonder how victory can be achieved without expectations. The thought crossed my mind, yeah. One cannot think of victory without also considering its opposite. Defeat. And thinking of defeat distracts the mind from what must be done in order to win. Gotcha. And what must be done? Whatever destiny obliges one to do, one's giri. For he who deserts his obligation is already defeated. Thank you, Sensei. You've given me a lot to think about. Cyclonus, report! Scourge has passed through warp gate 09A, out of visual range. Faster, then! I wish to see the look on Scourge's face as I demolish him! Target in view! Remember, Decepticons! Your mission, your only mission, is to destroy! Scourge has already launched his assault. He doesn't 
know the meaning of the word assault. But he's going to learn! We're trapped! We'll be killed! Remarkable! The woman is clairvoyant! The destructive power of your own Matrix! The Matrix did this to you? Then I have to take it back. I see now it is my obligation. I belong to it! As much as it belongs to me! You must die! Not today! home, folks. Scourge! Where are you, Scourge? Scourge! Mighty Galvatron! No! Galvatron! You don't understand! Understand what? It wasn't my fault! It was the Matrix! The Matrix? And this too is the fault of the Matrix! You did okay without me. Hot Rod, uh, Rodimus. Well, son of a gun. Found that missing part, huh? Not just the Matrix Cup. A missing part of myself. And that's the point, son. No matter who carries the Matrix, that part's what you'll never lose. The Decepticons are a malevolent race of robot warriors. Brutal and merciless, the Decepticons are driven by a single, undeviating goal. Total domination of the universe. In the war that raged between the Decepticons and Autobots for millions of years, their home planet of Cybertron was drained of its once rich sources of energy. In hopes of finding new reserves for making Energon their basic fuel, the Decepticons followed the Autobots to Earth. Huh? What is it? Laser beak. Prepare for flight. Operation Destruction. Fire it! Under the leadership of the ruthless Megatron, they continued their efforts to destroy the remaining Autobot forces. They attacked throughout the Earth and in space using their underwater Decepticon headquarters as their staging base and bunker. But by the year 2000, the Decepticons had proven to be the losers of the last great war. In an attempt to bolster the Decepticon's strength, the evil planet-gobbling world Unicron reformed Megatron into a new robot named Galvatron to lead the Decepticons in a new era. Now, in 2006, the Decepticons have retreated to a burned-out hulk of a planet called Char, a world of ash and ruin. Galvatron and his Decepticon lieutenants, the sleek and awesome Cyclonus, and the mighty Scourge, the master of the dreaded sweeps, strike fear throughout the universe. Their ultimate goal, to reconquer Cybertron and destroy the Autobots.